Oculus 2 to class today on this Friday the 18th. How exciting. I love to hear the word Friday like you guys do also. So the week is over. Finish well and enjoy your weekend. Um, so welcome to class today. We might have a test next week. I'm going to look ahead and see how that factors into things. Uh, no play on words intended there. Factor. Get it. Okay, moving on. Anyways, so maybe a test next week. Maybe not. At this time, at this time you owe me a homework assignment that I gave to you on Wednesday. Okay, so um, it's due today. Put your name on it and turn that in now at this time. Okay, please get your homework out. Put your name on it and turn it in now at this time. Um, bonus points. There were, I think, five of you that had bonus points. Let me see if I can pull that up real quick. I should have had that up already, but I don't, so hold on one second here and see if we can pull this up. I'll just pause the video here. Oh, there we go. All right, let's see what we got here. Okay, there we go, guys. We're back in business. These are the only five students that turned the assignment in yesterday for bonus points on their quiz today. Now, I don't want these five students who are getting mad at me. I've always trusted my students. I just expect you to be honest, and I trust you to be honest. I know one of you five, it doesn't matter which one, one of you emailed me last night and said, hey, I forgot to turn it in. I said, no problem. So if anybody did have it done yesterday and you forgot to turn it in, just let me know, okay? But these are the five that have the bonus points, okay? All right, moving on. Here we go. Um, today, we will be taking a quiz and then. Now, listen, I've really been pushing you guys. I know that, and it's good for you. But I'm going to back off a little bit today and give you a little breathing room. I can sense I'm sure there's a little stress coming on, and it's the end of the week, so I'm actually going to be nice for like the third time in my life. And what we're going to do today is take a quiz. Then I was going to have you finish the video and then have homework over the weekend. But I'm going to back off. I am going to have you finish the video today in class. And if you don't finish it, finish it over the weekend. But I'm not going to give you homework except to finish the video if you don't finish it in class. So on Monday, we're going to do go over your quiz you're taking today. Go over your test. We'll talk about that later. But um, you're... Um, that's all we're going to do today is take a quiz and then take some notes. No homework over the weekend. Now, this right here is exactly what I told you yesterday. I cut and pasted this right out of yesterday's video, so you really don't need to read it again. I'm just telling you what the video is about, and I'm telling you the name of the video. Graphing sine and cosine functions, 58 minutes long. Now, there is no homework except you need to finish this video right here. If you don't finish it in class today, Mrs. Stewart knows where you guys left off. So start the video there when you're done with the quizzes, okay? Then over the weekend, finish this video. And I was going to give you homework on top of that, and I'm not going to. I'm going to back off a little bit, give you guys a little bit of a break. Now, let's talk about your test. Yesterday, Shin took his test. And by the way, Shin, I've graded it. It's on Sycamore if you want to know your grade. Actually, they're being passed back today. So everyone has your test. Now, listen, I told you we were going to go over it. But what I didn't know is that the video would conk out on Wednesday, thus putting us behind a little bit. So we're going to go over these on Monday in class. Okay, so you've got your tests. Hold on to them. Put them in your folder. Bring them to class on Monday. So Monday we're going to go over your test. We're going to go over today's quiz you're taking Monday, as long as everybody takes it today. And we're going to work on homework Monday in class. Um, so we will be going over your test. I'm not being lazy. I just had no idea that Wednesday's video would conk out and that we'd be behind a little bit. So um, we'll be going over that on Monday. Now, some of you have been asking, do I have to memorize the special triangles? Of course you do. That chart, you know, with 60 degrees, 30 degrees, 45 degrees, and sine, cosine, tangent. I would not memorize the chart if I were you. I would just, on the side of your quiz, I would very quickly very quickly draw 45 45 that's a really nice triangle i would draw 45 45 90 triangle put a one here one here square root of two and then you're good i would draw a 30 60 90 triangle i would put 30 up here 
60 down here, a right angle here, I'd put a 2 here, a 1 here, and a square root of 3 here. That's all you got to memorize are your special triangles, and from those two triangles, you can get out any trick function you want to, if it's 30, 60, or 45 degrees, okay? All right, at this time, let's go ahead and pause the video, pass out your quizzes, and then restart the video once everyone has a quiz on their desk. All right, let's go over your quizzes, and I've got one somewhere. Here it is, okay. Um really not a lot to say guys number one give me the six values of the trick function I've given you at point on the terminal side oh and by the way another reason I'm not really giving you homework is this quiz is going to take a large portion of the um, class period so that's why um, just finish the video over the weekend no homework and we'll come into class on Monday and work on homework together okay all right this is a long quiz all right number two <coughs>